So here's a closer look at how to use your wick trimmings and wick tabs to create new wicks for your candles. This works really well with shorter jars of the same size. Larger jars, sometimes you might not have enough wick left over to use again. After you make your candle and trim your wick, you're going to want to hold onto that wick clipping. And then you're going to thread it right through the bottom of the wick tab. You'll also want to leave enough space at the bottom for a wick sticker later. Then you take a small tool, like a pliers, or I like to use a jewelry tool, and you can just clamp the top of that wick tab, securing the wick in place. You should be able to tug on it pretty hard. Then you can go ahead and put your wick sticker on as usual, and then hopefully center it in your jar. Now you're all set to make your next candle. 